Hey, y'all. Okay, so I had to come back live because I had to give a thank you to someone um, that has sent a wonderful gift. Her name is Magical Maiden. And I want to give her a shout out because she made all of these things for me. Uh, or she made them. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys what she made and sent me. She made this beautiful pendant with seashells and like um, this beautiful silver uh, background and things like that on the back. And it has like a really large loop so you can wear any size necklace with it. And there's seashells and they're really pretty. And it's like a reddish orange background. She also sent more. This one is very beautiful. Um, it is a sparkly starfish. So that would look really good. Like on a necklace like this. Isn't that cute? Uh, and I can actually put it on one of these because it's large enough to fit a small bead, beaded necklace through. Okay. Ooh, I really like this one. It's a really pretty purplish blue sparkly background with a seahorse. So this appeals to my Pisces side, yes. Love, love, love. So she sent me those. She sent me more things too. So let's see what this is. Ooh, wow, more seashells. This is a rectangle one. And this has like pinks and corals in it. So that color is really pretty. And then in the back, there's like a little heart and it's a flat piece. Um, you can even wear this reversible if you just wanted like the silver thing with the heart, but it's really pretty. So she sent me that and more stuff. Hold on. Wow, she sent me a bunch of stuff. What? Okay. I'm going to have jewelry for every day of the week and more. So she sent me a green small one with seashells. And this one is really pretty. It's like um, blue iridescent with green in it. Um, it's not argon. No, it's seashells. So isn't that beautiful? There's a, a blue one. And she made all of these, you guys. So she also made some, wow, some beautiful earrings. She knows I love chandelier earrings, I see. So she sent me these. Beautiful, right? She sent me those. Ooh. And very pretty, yes. So she made these, how talented. Okay, there's more earrings. These are more of an emerald green, a darker emerald green. And look at that filigree silver um, design. Isn't that beautiful? I can wear this right now. Match this. Hmm, maybe I'll switch my earrings. I'm excited for these. So I can show them off. So magical looking, right? Um, switch these out. So I really like these. Okay, next, she sent me some. Ooh, these are magical. Look at these. Ooh, do y'all know what that symbol is? It's Celtic. That red and black. Let me try to hold it still. Are these nice? Yes. The try. Nobody said it yet? <gasps> yes. John Brennan got it. 
the tri the tri quad oh I thought I had the bag mm -hmm. yes okay so next oh wait there's more oh my god lady you have spoiled me okay there is a green starfish um there's a purple seashell neck necklace um pendant sasha i'm on i'm online baby what's up you did did you do your draw <gasps> oh i like this one. it's like dark but sparkly looks like something uh maleficent look how look how it looks from far away when the light hits it you like that one you look like these kind of like hooks for no they're for necklaces. Do you like one? And hooks for your necklaces. Mm-hmm. This more. looks like what air like a dark aerial wear. Mm-hmm. Mermaid. Very mermaid-esque. Ooh, here's ooh. This one is very like look at the colors in that one. I'm gonna put it on my chest so you guys can see it. It like sparkles. Ooh! No! Children, I make it extra excited. Okay, there's a few more, and then, then that will be it. This is a really pretty blue one with seashells, so it kind of reminds me of the ocean floor or the Caribbean ocean floor. It's really pretty. Um, so wow, there's another one. I am going to be wearing. Oh, this one is like a double one. Like, you'll see that. It's like on both sides. It's almost like a bolt. So this one is clear with a bunch of seashells. Yeah, and I love the little packaging in the bag. So pretty. I'm gonna have fun. I like this one. This is really pretty. Uh, she sent me this really pretty necklace. So I'm gonna open it up. These are like the highlight beads. And I'm going to try it on right now. It's reversible. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh, the beads on it are like iridescent. Okay, so here we go. I have a whole new jewelry wardrobe now. Now I really do look like a gypsy with all this wonderful jewelry. I am very happy today. <laughs> um, I really like these pieces. Like, no lie, ooh, I could even put it on a choker and just be like fierce. Ooh. Oops! I know, I know. Don't kill me! Don't kill me! I can put this on a choker. Cause it's, you can stick like a ribbon through it and tie it if you have a black ribbon or I don't know, I can, I can find a way. But look at that, this one, this one is probably really going to be something that I wear a lot. I really like this one too. And the ones with all the um, seashells and things like that. I really like those for daytime, casual looks. Um, this one is really pretty too. So, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. She said she was trying to send me more. And I'm like, really? This is a, this is a lot. So, uh, I do welcome more. <laughs> so, thank you so much. You know what? You could even make these into rings. Look, you see how I have this big ring? Just, just for some ideas. This would be beautiful as a ring too. And you just get like a um, ring band, glue it on or weld it on, however you guys do it. And bam, look at that. So I really like it. I love this necklace too, because it looks, so I took the other necklaces off. Let me just put it behind my hair so you can see what it looks like. This is what it would look like alone. Look at what goes into the cleavage. What you trying to do? Mm -hmm. Trying to direct eye somewhere? <laughs> mm -hmm. So, 
I, I really like these. Uh oh, got caught in my hair. But luckily, it's easy to get uncaught. I think you're supposed to like close it up like that. Yeah, so that it does close. I just didn't close it. So, ooh, so happy. I love the green. So thank you, Magical Maid. I see you in here. I really appreciate it. It's beautiful jewelry, and I really love your work. Do you sell these? She's in the comments. Do you sell these? She's selling them. Okay, what's your website, girl? You know, you got to type that up in here. You're in the middle of making your website? Well, you need to give them some type of email or contact so they can contact you because you know they want to come back from you. Okay. Do you have a contact information that they can get some from? Mm -hmm. So I really like I really like the idea of these on beads. Let's do something like this. <laughs> You got a Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, something? Kenny Williams is asking. <laughs> okay. Wow, I, just, I wanna put some I wanna put this on a chain right now. That's how much I really like this one. Um let me see if I can work something out. Go make a insta real quick. To keep us informed, they say. They really like your work. You have all these people that want to see what you're doing. Um, and purchase from you. It will, okay, when you add, when you put the link in, put a space in between dot com. Whatever, 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 space, and then dot com. And they'll figure it out because you can't put links unless you put like a space. You know what I mean? I know, it's technical. So just put, oh, she has a, a channel and she she has her Facebook link on there. But um, just put, is that your channel? Is that your channel link? Just put a space in between or, okay, I'm trying, trying to pick this up, but I see, I can't do it from this angle. Mm -hmm. I'll have to put like a, little chain on, I mean a little loop on it to hook it. But it's beautiful. I really like it. Even on a cord or rope would be really pretty. You know, or a silver necklace. Um <laughs> right. I love it. So thank you. This was really a gift. She didn't really want me to promote her. She just wanted me to have a gift. So it was my choice because she sent me so much, you know. So thank you. Um, find her on Facebook. Is that your name on Facebook? Magical Maiden with a, with a K in magic. Magical? Okay. There might be other Magical Maidens, so you might need to put the Facebook link with a space in between it. And some of the letters. Mm -hmm. It's okay. They'll find you if they want, really like your stuff and want to buy. Right. But she's not really ready, I guess, to sell yet, perhaps. I don't know. But when you're ready to sell, when your website is up, just contact me again. And I'll put the link in the description on this video. Or you can make another video. Mm -hmm. So, very great work. I mean, it's very creative. I like the seashells. I really like this idea. Even though it's not um, crystals or argonite, it, look how it looks from far away. It catches light. It's just, it's, it's still magical looking. It's very creative and like it catches your eye. It's like, what is that? Right? 
love it i have a pendant for every day of the month basically because that's how much you sent me and it's really pretty like if you're going to the beach or you're wearing something summery the seashell um i can clip this on one of these things now let's see because it has like this um uh, or did she yeah it has like a, a clip where you can adjust it or create like a space so you can put it on a necklace. Oops. I have to take it out because I'm kind of clumsy at doing this online. But it would hang on there. Really nice. Like so. Let me just like that. You can add extra stuff to your own jewelry, like I just did. Mm -hmm. She says she can make them if someone wants to email her at Bobby, B O B B I E, 9965 at gmail.com. So there's her email, it's in there. Okay, so ooh, look at this. This is just already pretty. And it's almost like I have this double chain right here. I'm gonna wear this like this. So thank you, girl. This is really beautiful. And I love the earrings. Her earrings are beautiful, look at that. It's like, these will cost probably about, in the store, you'd pay a good price for these, you know? Mm-hmm. Thank you. I really like the earrings. It kind of matches because there's green in here. See? I look very magical now that you've helped me out. You've helped me get a more magical look today. <laughs> a more magical look. Um, so I really appreciate everything you have sent me. It's beautiful. You'll probably see me wearing it on a couple of videos, you know. Um, coming up because I'll be wearing a lot because I really like this. They're going to be like, and I'm going to tell you, you need to go get your website up today or at least an Instagram because if I wear it, people are going to ask me where I got it from. And if I say, oh, I don't know, they don't website. You know, so go get it done. Just put up anything and then get you a big website. Everybody, you know, when you start off, Start off small and just put an Instagram up and say taking orders. That's your website right there. Quick, fast, and in two minutes. Then you can work on your website. And then so you can say website coming soon. But you need us, you know, something. Yeah. Then you can prepare people and they'll start following you before you even start your website. And as soon as you launch your website, you already have automatic clients. So awaiting. You get you got it on that Facebook link. Okay. So she's on Facebook, not Instagram. So y'all gotta go get her um, magical maiden on Facebook. And then she left her email. And hopefully by then I'll have the link all good already. Just send it to me in my inbox and I'll put it on this video at the bottom. Okay. Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. Um, for watching and thank you magical maiden I had I went to check my mail and all that came in this little bitty box <laughs> I was like amazed how you fit all that in here <laughs> okay you're very good at packing items I promise you okay will you be live in the group anymore anytime soon should I be live in the group Kenny what do you want me to talk about we have a deep subject that we we can discuss. I could go live in a, in a few minutes. If I'm here. I'm... <laughs> you stuffed it in there, magical. <laughs> um, you did a great job. You're good at packing stuff. I, I tell you that. And nothing was broke or damaged or anything. It was, it was perfect. And it came all the way from NY up down to Texas. <laughs> 
<laughs> Thank you, B girl. Okay, I need a subject and a topic, so I'll just go in the group and we'll talk and get, get us something to talk about there. How about that? If y'all want to join the dark energy group on Facebook to discuss deeper things and, you know, get challenges and manifesting tips and challenges to help you manifest and become more aware and conscious, um, just email, not emailing, but, uh, Click on my Facebook link on my YouTube channel page. It's going to be the little icon in the top where my little artwork channel art is. And instant message me. I want to join the spiritual group. Okay. It's a paid group. Let's see. Okay. Magical Maiden says, go to her YouTube channel and my video on DIY crafts playlist. Okay. You want to get in, Bianca? Okay, you got to instant message me on Facebook. And it is Friday the 13th, and I have some good news for y'all. Sasha and I are going to do a spirit board live session tonight on Friday the 13th up in the little office witchy room area. It was Sasha's idea, not mine, okay? So... Since I've been taking the drops, I've been giving Sasha the drops. We're going to see if there's anything different or whatever. I don't know. Y'all like my fake tattoo? It's already peeling. Darn it. <laughs> yeah, I got like a bunch of fake tattoos from uh, this little cute dollar website. And they had spiritual ones. And I was like, wow, I'm getting some. And there's some with black cats, unks, eye of raw. Okay. You were born on Friday the 13th? Wow. Mm -hmm. Well, Friday the 13th is good luck to witches. You know, it's, it's a good luck day. So um, everyone else that thinks it's bad luck. They're just not in the know, okay? Mm -hmm. It's good luck to me. Look what I got. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Friday the 13th was good to me. <laughs> I felt like I just went shopping. And I didn't even spend any money. Hmm. Got some new earrings, new pendants, necklace. <laughs> okay. Anything good happened to you guys today on Friday the 13th? Like, thank you. Someone says I look fat. Thank you. I try. <laughs> you bought your mega million ticket today. You hope it's good for you. Good. Me too. You know what? I don't play the lottery or the lotto, but if I did, y'all want me to tell you how I would do it? Um, the elixir came today. Oh, good, Kenny. Okay, so if I played the lottery, this is what I would do. Um, I would do it three ways. I would buy three lottery tickets at the same time. And I would play whatever numbers that were meaningful to me as far as abundance. And then I would like, um, I would look up the numbers and see what they mean and according to the date and you know, all that kind of alchemy stuff and occult thing. So um, I would be like, okay, so today is what? Friday, Venus, love, you know, uh, what number represents love? I'm going to put that there, okay? So I'll pick my numbers like that. Then I'll buy a scratch off. And then um, I'll do an arm um, where they automatically pick your numbers for you. So I'm getting three. Scratch off, automatic pick, and then I'll pick my own numbers. And then I will take the automatic pick number and I will take the scratch off and I'll place them on my altar in front of a mirror or a scrying mirror, a black mirror. And I will light 
I will do a ritual with a Santi Muerte, or um, I will manifest with the dark energy and do the ritual um, to bring in abundance. But I will most likely do this on a Thursday because that's a day for money. And then I will take um, the one that I picked and I will put that, I will sleep with it, keep it on me so I can get my vibrations and stuff. And then when it's time to, to reveal, you know, the lotto, lotto numbers or whatever, I'll be ready. That's how I do mine. But I really don't play lotto because it's like, to me, it's like, mm, when you play lotto, there is a certain way of thinking. You've got to vibrate on a certain vibration. And when they put the odds like, out, like, oh, you know how uh, hard it is to win the lottery? That's in your subconscious mind. So automatically, if you think like that. But some people play it so much, and they become almost addicted to playing it. Their vibration starts to change as if it's going to be me. It's going to be me. One day, I just know. You know, because... Usually the lottery winners are people that have played for years. You don't see somebody, oh, I just found a lottery ticket or I decided to buy one one day because I don't ever play. It's always the people that really buy, you know, every every time they go to the store. So they became so, you know, into the idea of winning. Their thoughts created their path to win. Okay. But since I don't play. I would have to start playing for years and years and years to get that frequency correct, you know. But since I don't play, I don't, you know, I wouldn't really be a good uh, example of winning on the first try. So if you want to get into playing stuff like that, try to buy on special days like Friday the 13th, you know, days that have lots of energy around them. Play often. Get your hopes up. <laughs> But don't get disappointed when you lose. Say next time. I know it's going to be me. You know, I can feel it. Keep raising that vibration and keep that idea that it's going to be you. And it's going to grow each time. You know, because you might see numbers that were similar to yours that you chose. But, you know, so just you guys stay in that frequency. I'm not, I wouldn't be able to do it, do it because I just don't think about buying lottery tickets. So if you are, do it like that, okay? Because that's how I do it. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. Exactly. And But see, I don't think about that a lot. So, yeah, I already won the lotto. <laughs> but if I, if I did not win the lotto and it was something that I wanted to do, I, I would put my energy into it. I sure would, okay? Because uh, a lot of people have been asking me about lotto and stuff like that lately so I thought I'd address it mm -hmm. hey hey y'all okay so thank you um I don't know what time we're gonna go live with the spirit board session I let me see if I have anything to do this evening as far as spell work two Okay, I got two things to do, and then we'll do the video. <laughs> Yay! I thought I was going to be out of town this weekend, but I'm not, so I didn't. Did you accidentally it. summon me? Seriously, did I accidentally summon him? No, I did not. <laughs> Sasha, what time do you want to go live tonight? 3 a.m., that's too early. I mean, too late. You know, it won't be Friday the 13th anymore. It'll be Friday the 14th. Hmm. How about 11? 11, right before midnight. And we're going to go live. Mm -hmm. And you know that dog that was haunted? Mm -hmm. We can bring that in. The haunted dog, we're going to bring that in. And for the ghost to communicate. Mm -hmm. And we're going to use the ghost app, ghost radio app. 
still be there. All right. So I'm going to set my alarm uh, for, are you okay? Siri, set the alarm for 11 p.m. tonight. The alarm set for 11 p.m. Right. <laughs> I'm make this, can I make this a draw, draw dress? Mm -mm. That's too big. You know, I like cut it. You wear it a few more times before you do that. Fine. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, if y'all go download the app, I think it's like 99 cents, or they have some free ones with different names. You know, whatever you got. Mm -hmm. So this will be fun. We can light a bunch of candles, Sasha. Turn the lights lower. Cool. <laughs> You've paid 99 cents for Ghost Radar and Legacy. How is that one, Toshi? Does it have like a radar and it senses if there's ghosts in the room? Because I think I've seen that one. I don't want to know if something's sitting next to me though, okay? <laughs> Why? Hmm? Why? Hmm. You freak out? No. I wouldn't freak out. I just don't want to. Because like, it's a mystery. Because <laughs> you might get jealous, Sasha. You know, you're jealous of me, right? Sasha's very possess possessive of me. <laughs> it's not all about me. Ooh. This baby. Okay. Yeah, it's a radar and it shows me the intensity. I freaked out when I saw the dot was bright red. Oh, I think I I think I tried that app or something similar to it. I don't know, maybe. It also says words out loud. Yeah, the one I have does too. It says words. Okay. There's like some really good ones that are kind of expensive, like twenty dollars, and it's like a um, what is that? One? The ones that are like twenty dollars are I don't know. I have to look at them, but they're <laughs> why do demons look like monsters? Well, I thought little baby demons are so cute. <laughs> Like fourteen demons. They just look different. You know? I mean, like we could look like monsters to them, right? Why do humans look so ugly? They look evil. <laughs> they just look different. You know, when I was where did I? I had this this weird astral traveler dream or something, and I saw like weird looking creatures that did look demonic or evil. I had a scary dream. But then I was like. But they're not doing anything bad. They look cute, somewhat, and they're not doing anything evil. No, I'm not judging them. I'm not gonna judge them on how they look. Just this, you know, because they're. Well, I'm not. They're. Uh, I'm in their territory. They're not in mine. That's how they're supposed to look there. <laughs> so. I just say, you know, maybe that's just how they look. Skunks are adorable. However, skunks came from the planet of Smellatorium. Smellatorium. Sasha putting them earrings on. It's beautiful. Sasha, look at you. <laughs> hey. Don't laugh at my beautiful earrings. One of the subscribers made them for her. Okay. Look at Sasha. I look kind of like a total diva. I look fashionable. Mm -hmm. Diva plastic. Diva plastic. You want the next? You want to wear the next? Yeah. Next. This is very heavy on my ears. Because you have little baby ears. They're not heavy on us. They have big, strong mama ears here. Mama. <laughs> Turn around. She has a skinny neck, so you know. <laughs> A choker is not a choker. 
Just like leg, tights and leggings are not. <laughs> These are supposed to be tights, but I'm wearing Okay, Shiva, they're like giant pants. <laughs> Oh, that's because they're Layla's. <laughs> oh, yeah. My other one can't fit. You love snakes, and you have six-foot-long albino corn snake. Wow. You look good, Sasha Joe. You look, look good. Fabulous. You miss time to go away, my fabulousness. Did you see all of the... Um, and snatch off my weave and put on a bonnet on my head. So she said she was snatch off her. Oh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so thank you. Okay. This is really pretty. I love this. I must have taken you a long time to make this because I can see all the um the detail that you put into these. Like look at these. Like there's beads in between beads in between beads. And it's really nice quality. Yeah. Yes, it looks like it actually came from a um, jewelry shop. Yeah, it looks like something you'd find in Charm and Charlie's or something like that. So great work. I think these are supposed to go with it, kind of. These beads, these. You had it. Oh, yeah, come on. The cheeks of these two songs. What? Those beautiful. What? Mm -hmm. Thank you, I love Charm and Charlie's. Okay. Please. I think you're going to have a great business, by the way, because this is, these are really nice pieces. Yeah, it's not something I would make, but just like a bunch of beads in a row. Sasha would just put all a bunch of beads in a row and tie strings. That's her jewelry making. <laughs> hope it, I hope it fits. <laughs> Those are all pierced collars for me. Oh. They can actually fit in your finger. Ooh. What's that? Some people All right, well, we'll see y'all tonight around 11 p.m. Central Time. So right now it's 8 11. So we'll see y'all in a few hours, okay? Y'all be here. We're going to turn off the lights, put a little light on because she's scared. Put some candles. And we're going to contact some spirits. And I'm going to be using the Ghost Radio app as well. It's as the something strange. As the spirit board. In the neighborhood. When you wanna come? Come to the It will be live. Oh, have to the phone. Alright, y'all. Bye. Yeah. Thank you, Magical Maiden. I'm Queen Magical.